Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. Welcome to AOL. This is a bearish golden gap that's set up here today. And I made an, just an unbelievable call on this today. I mean, an unbelievable call on this today. Went to the target, past the target, to the dream target. You know, I don't have 100% conviction to set up here in the afternoon. Could it? Yes, but the market's very bullish. It's 11 o'clock. The stock went crazy this morning. And I really think this is going to close today if it doesn't set up this afternoon with a massive bottoming tail. Could it set up on the 15-minute chart? Yes. Do I have 100% conviction it's going to? No. No, I don't. Because this chart in this stock had a bearish move today, okay, did have institutional selling that came into it, which I'm going to go over with the entry. But the chart isn't broken here in AOL, and the market's really strong today. And AOL is a market stock. Look, see here, look at this. Anyways, here's the first entry if you want to do it. Drops, breaks, stops kind of big, but it is AOL. I mean, this isn't a cheap price point. It's not what I call expensive, though. Fell, dropped, rallied. Here's the call I made. I mean, this is insane. <sighs> 90 by 41.10, 20 cents. From this call at 90, at 40.90, the stock, with a 20 cent stock, with no let up, the stock went down <clears throat> and went a dollar 60 without blinking an eye, which is eight hours, went past the first target. And if you held it into, really, if you held it actually into the time of the day, if you held it into 10 o'clock, this is crazy. It was a more than 10 hour play. There's nothing to do in this here here. This is way too late. So, I mean, this was an amazing call I made. And it's because of the entry and the stop. And again, you have to know where to put stops. You have to know how to take a trade. You have to know where to enter the stock live on the day. What a great call this was. I, I, I just... There is no one that can read the first five minutes of the day in a stock than me. No one. And it's because I know how to read gaps. It is because I know how to read gaps and I can read the first five minutes of the day to call those kind of entries with the stops and take the trade. I mean, that is how I'm able to read that stuff and how I'm able to read when something works or it doesn't work. I can tell. I, I, sometimes I can tell right at the open. Sometimes I can tell in 60 seconds what something's going to do. But really, it's the first five minutes of the day. You know, I, I, I said this in the room this morning. If I had like a thousand people in the room, or if I ran like a trading desk where I had like, you know, a thousand people like trading on a floor, and I just looked at like eight or ten screens at once, I could call like everything I saw, long or short, and the market into the open with exact entries and stops. <laughs> I mean, I could call everything I see at once. Like, I would be capable of doing that, but I wouldn't be able to trade at the same time and do that. If someone paid me to do that, I could do that expertly. There, there's no one that can call the first five minutes of the day in a stock like me. There's no one that can call entries the way that I can with the right with the right risk to reward because I absolutely know where the number is. So great move in AOL today. The thing is, though, the market's bullish and it's 11.05. And if you didn't get AOL this morning, there's no reason to do this, af this afternoon because I don't have enough. 100% conviction it goes down again, back down and lower, it has any short move in it. Could it? Yes. Why? The stock, you know, got clobbered this morning. But the fact is the market is very bullish. The fact is this chart is still intact. It had a nice sell-off today, but it's there's nothing wrong with AOL. Uh, but it was a nice bearish gap here this morning that had a good move. And again, you have to look at each gap individually in the morning and you rate it. Then you also have to get the setup in the live day. This is why being in the live trading room helps people to take the trades after the class because you learn what to do, but then you got to react quick enough to get it, to take it, to do it. Because you can't make any money if you don't actually take the trade. And you have to know where to take the trade because even if you're prepared to trade it, what if it doesn't set up? Sometimes I see something that I like in the pre-market that does not set up right into the open, doesn't trigger set up, have an entry, therefore I don't take it. So, you know, this is all part of learning the process, learning the Golden Gap system and becoming a good trader. You've got to learn what to do. 
You have to learn what to do. And I have just such a good eye for these things here. Jeez. Massive Lulu's today. Actually, the volume isn't even crazy. I'm just looking in here. Volume isn't even nuts in this today, actually. So the next Golden Gap class is February 21st and 22nd. If you are interested in learning what I do and learning from me, I'm a great trader. If you want to learn how to read price action and see the entries and the setups and get it all down, you can take the Golden Gap class and learn from me. The class is $29.99. Email me at melissa at if you'd like more information to sign up. Have a good day, everyone.